Can of worms on you. Uh, can of worms, I'm about to open it. Heavy cat and flesh of coke in it. GD the bass with a dope in it. Pop a molly, now I'm poking it. Uh, feel like I might have a stroke in it. What's good, everybody? JJ Films here with another video. So, y'all know that site Wish that has very discounted stuff and you always want to look at reviews and stuff from there but either the videos aren't good and they have quality like this what's good everybody JJ Films here with another video people just don't review the item at all or it's not even there so I'm starting a series we're gonna do some wish hauls every now and then and you read the title of this one we're buying chains and watches so I think the budget for this video is about to be maybe like a hundred dollars and let's get into it first one I really want to check out is this 18k one that says it's free 16 inches 8 28 inches 28 is two dollars how long is 28 actually hold on guys I'm gonna get my measuring tape I'm gonna be right back so guys I'm back and I got my measuring tape That's 28. It says it's 18K. So I'm gonna buy it with Vicky for 180. Thanks, Vicky, for the 20 cents. 20 cents off. Thank you. So we're also gonna go for this men's bracelet over here. Wanna be Cuban Link uh, for $3. How much is shipping, actually? That's a weird behind price for shipping. So I don't want it anymore. The, uh, the $7.24 carat Cuban link. 24K gold, 925 silver plated, solid stainless steel chain, iced out diamond thick Miami Cuban link chain necklace hip hop jewelry. Hmm. So I think silver might come better. I don't want to spend ten dollars. I'm gonna keep it eighteen inches. How how much is eighteen inches? One of those. All right, I can do that. Nobody else is buying it. I'm gonna still at least open my availability to that. So here's some more like Cuban link bracelets. One. Should I get it in gold, rose gold, or silver to match my chain? Alright, so this is free. Shipping's $2. So, $2 bracelet? Sure, why not? This right here is what I need because I am a mother freaking gamer. Kid, I am terrible. But still, I'm a gamer ish. Not really. I suck. I casually play games, I am a video game player. Which is apparently what PewDiePie is, because that's what Google said. So, maybe I'm good. Maybe I'm not. You'll never know. He's Bye. trash. So, that camera ran out of space just a little while ago. We got it fixed up, so we're going to get back, back into it. So, we were looking at the controller chain. Video game controller, big pendant, cool fashion chain, gold plated necklace, hip hop. Unisex party club jewelry. We're getting it in gold because gold looks the best most of the time. We're bit of buying with A. Adria? Adria? Adria. We're buying with Adria. So we're saving 40 cents. And shipping's like 411. Alright. I'm gonna get this money bag chain so it looks like I have money. I want it in rose gold because I haven't gotten anything in rose gold yet. Actually, I'm gonna see what it looks like. I might get it in regular. Oh, I think I'm gonna get it in regular gold. Cause, so it's not a smart watch. It's just a regular digital watch. It looks nice though. Four dollars. Sure, why not? I'm on Wish. I'm wasting money anyway. And that's a fact. I kind of want one that looks good but you know oh like this one 
kind of looks like it could be an Apple Watch. Gotta, gotta flex like I have money even though I don't. Because I'm broke. Don't worry about it, it's fine. So it's $4, Bluetooth smartwatch, intellect, FM SIM card, anti-loss watch, pedometer for a smartphone. Select color. Gold, obviously. Doesn't change. I can buy with Ronnie, so I can get it for six thirty. Shipping is nine dollars. My total order is only forty nine bucks. I want some regular watches actually, because I only have one right now, and it's pretty decent. But I don't feel like wearing it all the time, so I'm just gonna look up. This one looks nice, and for only a dollar, I'm gonna get black and blue, black and silver. Sold out, of course. What about the leather version? Okay, so the leather version's two dollars. So this is the mesh belt. Still mesh. Actually, black and blue looks good. So I'm gonna go back to the mesh belt. Black and blue. It's three dollars actually, but I can get it for two two seventy. With, if I buy with Andrew. I'm gonna buy with Andrew. Gonna see how that goes. Free. Well, we can't just pass up free stuff. It's a thin watch though. I don't really want that. Oh, maybe I should buy a watch for my imaginary girlfriend. I'm not a very attractive person. I realize that. Which is why I'm, I'm gonna be forever single. Which is why I'm buying on Wish. There's this gold watch, it's free. I'm gonna get it any freaking way. So like color, silver, golden, of course golden's three, black is four, gold is four. I have to get it in silver. It actually doesn't look that good now that I'm looking at it. Is it see-through? No, it's just the inner workings. Sure. Shipping's three, so that's four dollars. I mean, yeah, it's three dollars. Actually, I think I was on here before and I saw a smart ring. I actually want to see what that does. It says you can unlock your phone just by tapping the ring on your phone, but then you just gotta make sure that nobody else gets the ring. So here it is, smart ring, the smart temperature ring. So it says you can call cool, NFC, multifunctional, waterproof, intelligent, digital, smart ring, Unisex, Android, Windows, High Speed, Magic Finger Rings. Alright, let's get it. Why not? We're on here to waste money. That's why we're on Wish. And that's a fact. Wearable equipment, Q18, smartwatch, Bluetooth clock, music watch, support SIM card for Android smartphones. Oh. And this is about it that I'm going to get for this video. So our total is $76. Let's review what we have. We have this smart watch for Androids. We have the smart ring. We have a silver watch, a black watch, a wannabe knockoff uh, Apple watch. We have just a regular digital watch. We have a money chain. We have a controller chain. We have a bracelet. We have that. And we have 18 chain that was free. And we're gonna use Honey. Not sponsored, by the way. Apply coupons. Let's see how much we can get off on this order. $7.65 off. So thank you to Honey, not sponsored. Continue to check out. Uh, I'm not giving my card information to these guys. You all must be insane. PayPal. My information is all over this, so we're gonna blur this, so blur, just blur everything. Better be blurred. Oh wait, I'm the editor. Who am I talking to? So, it's gonna take about a month for all of this stuff to show up. In the meantime, I'm still gonna be posting content. Don't worry about that. And so, I'll see you guys in about a month when all this stuff's supposed to show up. What's up guys, we're back. Um, so, it's been about a month, but everything finally came in. I have it just off camera over here. But, not everything took super long to come in. Like, uh, most of the stuff showed up. 
like two weeks after I ordered it, we just were waiting on like three items for the longest, and they were just not showing up at all. So, let's get started with the first item that we ordered. So you guys remember, the, uh, well obviously you remember, because it was just a couple minutes ago for you, but it's been like a month. And this is that 18 karat free gold chain that we got. Let me see if I can put this on. Like, it doesn't look bad, but it, it feels fake. Like, if I bend it right here and it pushes all together, I feel like if I pushed it hard enough, I would just snap the whole thing. So I don't really want to do that. But if you're just going for the looks, um, feels nice. I like the size, I like the length. It looks good, so... I'm gonna give all these items a rating out of 5. So I give this a 4 out of 5. Pretty good, not terrible. It's all around pretty decent, except it's fake. Like my friends. Like my ex. Ah, uh, they didn't say that. <clears throat> the second item that we ordered was the Silver Cuban Link. Now, it just feels like a normal stainless steel uh, necklace or a chain. Nothing all too exciting about that. I almost put it on backwards. Hold on. It fits exactly how I thought it was going to. I look pretty good, I think. It looks pretty good. Feels fine. I don't really like this right here. Because it's like... Kind of like a strong plastic at this point. The rest of this is stainless steel. And I feel like it would break. So the third item that we ordered, it was that gold-plated bracelet. Yeah, so... It's plastic, viewers. So on to the third item that we got. Y'all remember it was that gold-plated uh, freaking Cuban link. I wait, let me read it. Men's, women's, luxury, chain, hip hop, iced out, curb, Cuban, diamond, gold plated bracelet. Yeah. It's plastic. I mean, if you don't mind the fact that it's plastic, it doesn't look that terrible. And since it's plastic, at least it won't turn, so I guess you could kind of say that it's gold. Oh, never mind. It looks like it's already turning. Can't really show you guys because it probably wouldn't show up on the camera, but like right there. So I give this. How much did I spend on this? Too much money. Um, I'm gonna give that one a two. Did I rate this one? I don't remember if I rated this one. I give this one a four. Four out of five. I like the first one. Our third item was the video game controller chain that I have right here. Um, in the pictures, it looked like. A little more yellowish gold, but this one's more like a bronzish gold or like a deep gold color. Um, the Modern Warfare thing at the top kind of smudges together, so this quality is pretty nice. It's not plastic. <laughs> pretty sure it won't break. Doesn't feel that terrible. Let me put it on. It hangs about, I'd like to hang this one just a little bit lower because the pendant's so big, but other than that, this one's pretty good too. Um, I'm probably going to give this one a 4 out of 5 as well. We're not scoring everything too hard from on here because, yeah, it's from Wish, but probably nothing here is going to be a 5 out of 5. So, next we're going to the money bag chain. That actually, in the picture, unlike the last one, this one looked more goldish. This one came, like, 
really yellow. And I don't like how thin the chain is. Like it feels kind of flimsy, but it's actually pretty strong. Feel up. Oh, pulled on it a little bit, heard it crack a little bit. Um, so build quality is probably not that great. I like the pendant. The pendant's fine though. Like if you found another chain to put this on, it'd be great. So I'm gonna give this one a let me see. Probably gonna give this one like a three. Yeah, so this one gets like a three out of five. Our next item. Oh. So you guys remember that digital watch that I got and it kind of looks like an Apple Watch. Well, here it is. It looks decent, right? But this is very a very lightweight, like cheap plastic build. And I can't really show you guys on camera. And I can't really show you guys on camera, but if you shine the light, uh, if you get like the right lighting, you can see that there's a screw right here and right here. So you can see how like poor the build quality is. It's not that great. The band's kind of... It doesn't like to bend like to your wrist. Let me see if I can put this on. So it was kind of annoying to get this little stub through the hole right here. But other than that, the screen doesn't look how I thought it would. Like, it looked a lot better in the picture bracelet. I'm probably going to give this one a 2 too, because it actually works. So, so um, you can't really knock it for that. It looks fine on my wrist, but I probably wouldn't wear it anywhere. So the next one that we got was actually that smartwatch that was supposed to look... Like, oh, hold on. So the next item we have is that actual smartwatch that was supposed to kind of sort of look like the Apple Watch. It's kind of thick. The band is sort of like the last watch that's over there, but it's like a better build quality. It doesn't bend too much right here. But it would it looks like it would conform to my wrist a lot better than that other one because it was just like not going on there. And let's turn it on. Well it turned on, the battery's low, but it turned on. It says company mode up here. I have no idea what that means. Go through some of the features. Apparently I can connect it to my phone through Bluetooth. So we're gonna do that. All right, so I'm connected to the watch. Okay, just say connected again. I don't know why. But now I think I can like call people. It keeps telling me that the battery is low, so I'm probably not going to get to do that. But let's try it anyway. I'm going to I'm going to call my sister who's like right over there, and she better pick up. So it's calling right now. She answered. She actually answered. Congratulations. So the sound on this thing isn't too great. Can you hear me all right? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Uh, okay, talk again. Can you hear me? Can you hear me from the, from the watch? Is there a microphone on the watch? There you go. Oh. So it took a, lot, a little while, but I guess the mic started working. There's like other things we can do on here. There's a camera. I have no idea what this is. And it won't open without a special app, but I looked it up and that app does not exist. So, I can't really do anything about that. There's a browser, but I need a SIM card. Um, Twitter, Facebook, WhatsApp. It has a pedometer, so I can like track my steps. Two, three, four. It got five steps. 
I think I shook it a little more than five times. Replay that. My steps. Two, three, four. Oh, it went to 12. Never mind. Like, we could play music out of here, but the speaker's not great, so I don't see why that would be a thing that we want to do. Let me see if I can find a song. I'm not going to be able to play too much of it because copyright laws. YouTube, don't want to get my video demonetized, even though I'm not monetized. So, yeah, I give this a, for the price and the fact that it actually works and has some pretty nice functions on here, I'm going to give it a 3 out of 5. Oh, that men's classic black watch. So, this one came in, and I'm not sure if you guys know this, but packages that come from Wish say what they have inside of them on the package. So if the mail person wanted to like take your stuff, he'd be like, oh, there's a smartwatch in here. I'm going to take it. And this one came labeled as a toy. I was surprised that it actually worked because it doesn't have a second hand, but you can hear it tick. Probably not in this camera. But it actually tells time pretty well. You can't really tell where the second hand is, but I got the mesh belt. I don't think there was an option for this one. It was between mesh or leather. Oh yeah. It's kind of cold. I'm going to be like that. That's because it's metal. Feels fine. Looks pretty decent. Go call these. It didn't break. So, this one gets a four. The next one that we have was that, uh, like, see-through business watch, where you're supposed to, like, see the, the, see the gears and stuff that was inside the watch. And here it is. I thought that, like, the watch face was going to be a little bit wider, because that's how it kind of looked in the photos. But I'm fine with this. This one's also, also the mesh belt, but... This one's different, like... This one just feels smoother. That one was kind of... I don't know. It was something. Yeah, I'm looking at this right now. The inside kind of looks like it's made of, of, like, maybe aluminum. This is stainless steel, or it claims to be. There's glass on the back, and you can see the battery. Hello. Why? <laughs> but I really like this watch. It actually overall looks pretty good. So I'm going to give this one a 4. So the next item that we have is that NFC Smart Ring. Probably should have looked up what NFC was before I bought this. But apparently, but apparently you can like use it to make purchases if someone has, or like if a shop has an NFC pay thing, you can like take the ring and go like that and pay for something. But yeah, it's, it's kind of useless to me. Maybe we'll smash it at the end of the video. I haven't decided yet. And our next item is that other smartwatch. So actually, I do kind of like the build of this one better than the other one. Like this one's this one's lighter though. This one's kind of heavy. And I think the screen on this one is brighter and it just it overall feels like smoother and I'm probably going to connect it to my phone now. So it says it's connected. It looks like it has some other features. No, it still has the I didn't show the calculator on the other one, but this one has a calculator too. I like the look of the calculator better. The screen, it kind of just like flows a little bit better. And I like, I like the way that it's set up. This one also has a pedometer, sleep monitor, an anti-loss thing. I guess that if it disconnects from your phone through Bluetooth, it will like beep or something. Um. Oh, this one also has Bluetooth music. So we're going to play this one and see how it sounds. Yes. 
So, um, I actually like this speaker better than the other one. Like, it actually sounds, like, significantly better. Like, you can tell the difference. Hold on, let me see if I can pick another song. Maybe it was just that song. I know what you're probably thinking right now. You'll be like, Ugh, why does this guy have face paint on his face? Well, today is Friday. August the 16th. So, it was just two days under a month that everything finally showed up. And today's our game, our Sharks game against Vero. And so I got my face painted. Because they were doing it for free at lunch, and a friend of mine wanted to paint my face. And I was just like, sure, why not? And so, this is Trap Three Little Pigs by Kyle. So it's not like something that I would just choose to listen to my music on all the time because I have AirPods. Photoshop the AirPods in. Yeah, I have AirPods. I don't speak broke boy. So, um, this is a really nice smartwatch. I think it was actually cheaper than the other one. We can check that. The price is going to come up here. Um. The build quality is pretty good. I. Oh, we didn't check the camera. We should probably check. Oh, it like froze a little bit. Okay, now it's kind of like spazzing out. I probably shouldn't have thrown it. But. Yeah, I'm gonna go and fix that later. It says I shouldn't have thrown it. Throws it again. Th Okay, it's fine. Next. Oh, I don't think that I bought the rest of these items um, in the video. I bought them afterwards, so that actually bumped up the price a little bit from what you saw. I don't actually remember how much I spent, but the first one that we got was a one-up mushroom chain. Like, it, it came in looking better than I thought it was going to. I thought that the mushroom would be a little bit bigger, but I do like the size and the green is just like great. Hey, I just got a great idea. Hold on. I'm going to shine my flashlight through the back here since it's like mesh. See if that makes it look cool. Looks like a pretty decent effect. It's like staying stained glass window but yeah the build quality of the chain itself is pretty firm it's like something that you could get from the store not very expensive though and the mushroom itself looks great it's really reflective I don't see any missing uh, like stones. I thought there would be some missing stones because it's from Wish, but there's not any, there's none missing. They're all there. I really like this chain. Like, I think this one's like my favorite. So I'm gonna give this one a five. We just move on to our last two items, which I got a grill in rose gold. I didn't think I had gotten it in rose gold, but apparently I did. And one gold too. First off, right out the package, there's like paper stuck to this one. I'm trying to scratch it off, but it's not really coming off. Maybe he's... Yeah, it seems to be stuck on there really well. Or... Maybe it's not paper. Oh yeah, it's paper. It's coming off. Oh, there's the padding. The padding... This is used to like shape it to your tooth, so I'm not sure how th this is supposed to be in, inside, inside. Put them in the warm water, let them sit for 15 seconds, like it says. 
I'm gonna pull it out and I think I just place it on my teeth and it should like mold to my teeth. Like here's the rose gold. I can't remember if I got top or bottom. I think I got bottom. So yeah. Let's see. The shape's pretty fine right now. So I'm gonna go heat these up. I'll be right back, probably with the hot water to soak them, pull them out, and see how they fit. Hey guys, so my camera died while I was trying to put in the tiny gold tube. Where'd I throw it? Well, turns out that it didn't fit any of my teeth. It was all too it was too big for all of them. Even, and I know what you guys are thinking. You guys are like, hey, what about those giant behind teeth that you have sitting in front of your mouth? And well, I tried it on those. It was all it was still too big. And yeah, so I kinda got mad and I threw it somewhere. I have no idea where it is. And yeah, my camera's dead. I let the bottom grill soak a little bit more. And I put it in. It fits a lot nicer now, but it's still like pushing up when I'm done. Maybe like a couple more adjustments and this would be not terrible. Like I'd give these maybe like a three. That single tooth is getting a one though, cause it sucked. But anyway, but that's the video guys. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Tell me what you think I should buy next. I already have an idea of like my next two wish videos, but after that, you guys can just suggest things. If you find stuff, send it to me. I'll do a video where I buy everything that you guys suggested. And if you like the video, tell your friends. And I'll just see you next time. Till then, stay legendary. Well, that doesn't look like something that I need. Girl, you keep on this shit. Calling my name while she throwing it. And right, I know that I'm gonna go with it. Excuse me, holding it. That's how she wanted it.